You know this video has a higher production value than normal because I'm reading from a script, kind of. Uh, my name is Brian Saviano. You may know me as Bricks O'Brien. Hello. Welcome to this informal presentation of things that I have going on in the world of me. Today is my 25th birthday and I thought why not just lump together my birthday celebration along with all these things that conveniently enough accumulated into one day, which is my birthday. So obviously happy birthday to me. I'm so special and everything else like that, obviously. But even with all of that, I also wanted to take this time to say thank you for all of your support throughout 2020 and before then with watching the videos and the live streams and the merchandise and everything else like that. With your support, I'm able to still make videos and do the things that you want me to do so whatever way that you can support is appreciated subscribing to the youtube channel watching over on twitch if you are following me on any social media thank you all that support really keeps me going along with your kind words of all you reaching out all across the internet so really and truly thank you for everything that you've done over these past couple of years i hope i can keep bringing as much spicy content as often as i can in whatever way that i possibly can a lot of the times when people ask me what's going on, like what's coming down the line, I often refer to it as a bunch of chefs cooking things in the kitchen, okay? You are showing up to the restaurant of Bricks O'Brien, you sit down and you're waiting for a meal and you're getting a little impatient, you're like, where's my food, where's my food? But the food takes so long to prepare so we can give you the spiciest, the freshest, and the hottest meal we possibly can. And everything I have to announce today is a culmination of the chefs working their butts off and bringing you a very hot and spicy multiple course meal. Now I do enough talking in my gameplay videos, but I wanted to do even more talking. So I wanted to start something that really makes sense for me. So take a look at this. It can be interesting starting something new and seeing where it goes, something a bit out of the wheelhouse of what you're used to, and uh, that's kind of where I'm starting from right now. I finally have a podcast. My show is called the Out of the Bag Podcast, and it gives me an opportunity to dive deep on the topics that go beyond video games or Lego. Whether it's solo or with a guest, I'll be going into what's going on in my life, the world around us, and what is to look forward to in the future. The show's available on YouTube, but also available on podcasting platforms. So whatever way you want to listen, you can. I already have a few episodes posted on the YouTube channel and on those podcasting platforms so you can get an idea of what to expect. And I plan on uploading weekly and I'll ramp things up as I get along my way. I have some very interesting topic and cool guests lined up so you're really going to want to subscribe to the YouTube channel and follow across whatever podcast platform is your choice. Ideally, I'll take parts of my podcast and upload them in their own little section, so that way if you want to know my opinion on one specific thing, instead of it being inside of a gameplay video or lost in a live stream, you can look at that one little chunk and listen to it for yourself. All the links for that are going to be in the description down below, along with everything else I'm talking about today. I've mentioned it about 10,000 times on my live streams, as well as talked about it on social media, but if you didn't know, I have a LEGO kit. And this guy is called Build a Bob, and he's been available over on my Etsy shop for the past couple of months. But throughout the month of January, I'm actually offering this guy at a little bit of a discount because it's my 25th birthday. He's $25, so you get all of the things that you would normally get, but it's on sale. So hit the link in the description to go to the Etsy shop and get your Build a Bob while you can, because the stock is getting a little bit low on it, and I don't want this to go away before people message me and complain that they're not in stock anymore, just like with the Bricks O'Brien minifigure. And speaking of those live streams, a lot of you might know that I live stream on twitch.tv slash Bricks O'Brien. That's my place where I play Minecraft, Fortnite, Rocket League, whatever I want to play three times a week, that's where I end up playing it. And it gives me a great opportunity to talk to all of you in real time 
via the chat. So if you haven't had a chance to go over and check out the live streams, I would really appreciate it if you did. There's a lot more funny moments that happen that just don't happen in videos because the chat antagonizes me about my fictitious girlfriend or something I thought I said. It really is intense, but it's still family friendly and it's a very safe environment. So if you haven't gone over there to check it out, please do so. Uh, a goal of mine for this year is to actually reach Twitch partner, which means I need to have 75 concurrent viewers over 30 days. So if most of the people watching this tuned into my live streams more often, then that goal could be hit relatively easily because already so many of you watch. So if you haven't taken the chance to do it, please, I would really appreciate it if you did. It's a really good time and being a Twitch partner gets me opportunities to do sponsorships and just grow everything overall. So not that it's about having the check mark or anything like that, but because the numbers do get higher, it makes it more appealing for all these brands to be like, oh, you're actually doing something. Okay, cool. Y'all know that I love my coffee and it turns out the good people over at Coffee EXE stumbled into my live stream and really liked what they saw. So I actually have my own blend of coffee and it's uh, right over here. I would hold up the actual container of coffee, but it hasn't appeared in the mail at the time of this recording. Introducing Bricks O Brew. This Bricks O Brew coffee is an amazing Guatemalan single origin roasted medium with hints of chocolate, bright fruit, and butterscotch. And yes, I have had the coffee before. It is incredibly delicious. It tastes really freshly roasted compared to any other uh, chain coffee that I've ever had. So you're gonna be seeing me drinking that from now on. What I do is I take the coffee and I put it in like the coffee bag and I make a cold brew out of it and it, it works really, really well. So shout out to Roasted Riches and Coffee EXE for tuning into my live streams and they thought it was good enough that they wanted to do a coffee. So, you know, I drink coffee. So that's a thing now. So while doing this video, I forgot about another announcement that I had, and that's that I have my own website now. It acts as a hub to get in touch with all of my current projects. You learn a little bit more about me, and there's a contact form on there in case you want to reach out for any reason at all. And if you want to, you can go to the very bottom of the front page and sign up for the email list, which will let you get my live streaming schedule every single week, as well as whatever's going on with me in that email. For anybody that signs up for that email list, you're gonna get those updates, but I'm also offering my Minecraft skin as a download for you in case you haven't gotten yours already. And not just the old Bricks O'Brien Minecraft outfit, but the newly designed one as well. So make sure you go to my website and sign up for that email list so that way you know when it's going to be available for you to download and use for yourself if you really want to. And if you play Minecraft with me on my live streams, you'll know that sometimes I have like a creative building challenge where you claim a spot and build whatever it is I tell you to do. Well, it turns out me and a few others got cooking up for something really nice. That's right, it's a brand new creative map, so that way we can build amongst the Brick City. Shout out to Anthony, Eli, Brandino, and Joseph for helping create this incredibly awesome Minecraft map for all of us to build with. So when you join in on the Twitch live streams and play Minecraft with all of us, we can have a brand new map to explore, and we have those guys to thank for it. So big shout out to them. Thank you for making this possible. It looks amazing. And I know I just went on a whole thing about how I'm live streaming on Twitch, but there's actually something new that I'm going to be trying about live streaming on Amazon, which if you didn't know that's a thing, it is a thing. My buddy Brick and Nick told me about it, and it's a whole platform where you're basically talking about the products that you're using in your live streams, and it's more interactive in that way. But basically, I know that a lot of you have watched me through the power of prime time, so I wanted to give it a shot. And what I need you to do is to actually go and follow me over on my Amazon storefront. All you need to do is hit the link in the description and you'll go to my Amazon storefront and you just hit the follow button and literally that's it. And to sweeten the pot a little bit, I wanted to do a Lego Super Mario giveaway to anyone who follows me on my Amazon storefront page. 
So what you're going to do is take a screenshot of you following me on that storefront page and you're going to email that screenshot. And I'm going to draw a winner toward the middle of February, so hopefully you can get it by around Valentine's Day. You have a chance to win all the things that you see here on screen. I'm going to hook you up with the starter course and the Wiggler set that just came out. A lot of different LEGO Super Mario sets, so I would appreciate your follow. And you could win a bunch of cool stuff by going over there. So log into your Amazon account, follow me over there. It takes just a couple of seconds, and I would really appreciate it. Oh, wait, hold I'm sorry. I was... I was busy doing a little bit of coloring over here. Bet you weren't expecting that one, were you? That's right, ladies and gentlemen. I have my very own Bricks O'Brien coloring book. Over on my Teespring shop, you can download a 12-page PDF with all the various coloring pages to create a fantastical world of your own. Deck out your own world of Bricks O'Brien in whatever colors that you want to with this coloring book made by the team over at Teespring. And use the template in the very back of the coloring book to design your very own Bricks O'Brien inspired mascot. This one is a misprint. You're going to get the actual print. My printer was being a little wonky. So make sure you go into the description and get yourselves a Bricks O'Brien coloring book. That's pretty cool. I have to say my favorite ones of the bunch have to be either the Spaceman variant on a distant planet or the one that's inspired by like a tropical paradise with treasure, like a pirate or something. So go ahead and get yours today. And because I like sweetening the pot even more with everything that I do, I want you to make your very own Bricks O'Brien inspired avatar from the very back of the coloring book. And I want you to send your best one into the P.O. box. And whoever I think has best captured the likeness of the world that Bricks O'Brien is from and how interesting your character is, I'm going to give you a $30 gift card to the Lego store, which is valid online or in store. So go and send your submissions into P.O. Box 1448, Wakefield, Massachusetts, 01880. I'll be picking a winner toward the middle of February. So when you send in your submission, cut out whichever one of the frames you think is the best and send it into the P.O. Box along with your name and any other information I'd need to get in contact with you. And I can't wait to see what you come up with. And I really hope that you capture the essence of Bricks O'Brien and the world that he's in. I know that's a lot of stuff that the chefs are cooking up and hopefully you're handling the binge eating of Bricks O'Brien content adequately because I know it's a lot to take in. I'm pretty exhausted myself, but whenever there's these video presentations, there's always like these announcements that people put toward the end of it and they're like, oh, there's one more thing and we want to show you and I don't really have anything kind of like that. Wait, no, hold on. Wait, wait, wait. Actually, wait, I do have one more thing for you.